What's going on YouTube? It's Jason with JJ Drones and today we are going to do some unboxing. Um, you're going to have to excuse the mess. I am home on vacation and I don't have a studio yet. Yet. Let's get into the video. Now my wheels in motion and my windows open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way. I can feel it in the air. Here I go. So yeah, we've got some exciting times here with JJ Drones. Um, my wife and I decided that what we are going to do is we're going to create a studio in one of the rooms of the house. So the number one thing is I have horrible lighting. And so we took care of that during Prime Day. This is a box of lighting and I haven't even opened it yet. I got it in the mail. Well from UPS yesterday. So we're going to go ahead and open this up and see what we've got. And it looks like Laura wants to help. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, let him be in the video. Say hi, Laura. Hey, Laura, you say hi? You wanna say hi to the camera? Sit. Pretty? Good boy. That's the only trick he's got. Anyways, I got my knife. It says not to cut with a knife, but I'm not a big stickler on following instructions. Ah. Now I see why they didn't want to cut with a knife. This is what the lighting comes in. Very convenient carry bag. That is extremely nice. Um, I don't even remember the name of the lighting system. I guess it is uh, Skytex. <laughs> I'm no rocket scientist. Skytex is the name of the company that uh, I bought the lighting from. So we're gonna open this up and see what's in it. All right. Now this comes with two of the lighting setups. So there should be two of everything. Okay, and this is the shade. Check that out. And then this, I don't know what this is yet. I guess we could have gone into the instructions and found out what everything is, but uh, that's not the way we do things here. <laughs> okay. We're gonna have to figure out what this is, because I have no idea, but it looks like it. Okay, yeah, I don't have a clue. So we're gonna set that off to the side. So we do know what this is. So, and then this is just gonna be another one because like I said, it's just a setup for two. Now this, I would imagine is probably going to be like the, the legs. Yeah. Well, isn't that nice? So this works just like my tripod for the most part. Now, this is gonna be our lights. And both of the lights come with remote controls. And I didn't even think about batteries. So if they don't come with batteries, I'm gonna to have to pick some up at the store but we shall see when we get through all the boxes. This light. I 
goes into this here. Now, question of the day is the best way to put the light in. Again, I'm doing this without the instructions and I probably should read them. This is the Skytex LED Softbox Lighting Kit. And this tells you all the features, tells you what package includes two soft boxes, which is this, two LED bulbs, two stand studio high light stands, one carrying bag, one user's manual, and two remote and dinners dimmers uh, there's no battery in the remote control please buy it yourself I don't know if you can read that but that's what it says <laughs> installation the related videos in the project detail page great give me a minute and I'm gonna see how to put these light bulbs in okay all right so I learned not even from the Skytex, because the Skytex was not helpful at all. But push this down. And that locks it into place. And then put the bulb in. I'm sorry. See, now it's locked into place. I'm just gonna put the bulb in. And it is rattling, so I hope the bulb isn't broke. And voila. And again, there were no instructions in the box. It said to watch the video, but all the videos that I saw online were not for this setup at all. We're gonna to learn together what we're supposed to do here. Oh, maybe this does go on, stay on there. Because this, goes on the top like this. And then we just loosen this up and we can adjust this any way we want. So we've got that. Now, if we're gonna make it taller, we can make it as we want and there you have it let's plug this bad boy in and see what it looks like and check that out how's that for lighting <laughs> that is bright but when I was putting that on I realized this goes over, this is a lampshade. So you can soften up the light. And if you look at the camera, it's not that much softer, is it? But this will solve my lighting problem. Okay, so this remote takes AAA batteries. Got them put in there. I don't know if they're any good, but we're about to find out. So now, this can go, that's 100%, it's 50%, it's 20%, it's warm, ooh, cold, and then white. And then you can manually adjust it. Let's go back here, let's go warm. Okay. You see the difference? And I'm just adjusting it a little bit at a time. This is dimmer. This is brighter. Then auto.
Now, as you can see, this one is now working too. So I've got the both of them sitting right over here. Now, again, we can do the same thing as we did before. 100, 50, 20, warm, cold, white. And there you go. I mean, it seemed to be difficult at first, but after I watched one video on putting the light bulb in, it was extremely easy because I have no idea what I'm doing. And I admit that. But uh, pros and cons, number one, give directions. And if you're not gonna give directions, actually send a link for the video. Um, these remotes are really, really flimsy. I mean, this one was already cracked open when I got it. I mean, it's not broken, but it's just a snap together remote. So, and then these doors uh, are really, really difficult to close once you put the batteries in. In fact, if you can hear that, I'm just pushing against the door. So it's, there's no telling whether or not the batteries will stay in here, but operating these are pretty easy. What do you think of these lights? I think they're absolutely fantastic and they're going to be a great addition to the new studio that we're going to be putting together upstairs. So if you like this content, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever one of my videos gets uploaded to YouTube. In fact, Hopefully, we're going to have a whole bunch of videos as we renovate the one room into a studio. Go to jjdrones360.com. This is where you can find all of the information you need, JJ Drones. And you can go to my Facebook and my Instagram pages, JJ Drones 360 You can also join me every Sunday at 5 p.m. Central on a live stream. Tell your friends, tell your family. We have a whole lot of fun over here on the JJ Drones channel and I try and do the best videos for you guys as possible. <laughs> Laura's playing with his rawhide. But as for now, I appreciate you all for coming along for this ride with me and we'll see you later on down the road. Bye bye.